Hi guys, how you going? My name's Sam, I'm from CH Smith Marine. Today I'm going to be talking about the new Nav Eonix XL Platinum Fishing Data cards. These cards basically have a new bathymetric layer, um, gives you a whole lot of information, particularly with your contour lines, you'll find you get a lot more detail out of them than the standard. Uh, bear with me a second and I'll get it set up so you can have a proper look. Thanks. Righto, so this is the standard uh, platinum chart, just off Malacuda, we've got the shelf out here. If you want to zoom into, we get this kind of detail. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to enable the new data. The new data is described as fish and chips, and it can simply be found in your chart options on the Lorance, which is the same as the Simran. Once we find fish and chips, we just highlight it, press enter, and the new data is now live. The big thing you'll see immediately is that we've got even more contours than standard. If I look around here for instance I'm able to see any rise, any drop, the whole lot. And the more I zoom in the finer the detail. Here's a good example of the trench. Um, where we are at the moment it drops down to 2,000 metres from approximately 1,000. Uh, as you can see it is a big change and you can see your bombing here as well. The appeal of this to game fishermen is particularly high simply because you get more data. You get the images that you want, they're important and you're able to see them. Just so you get a comparison I'm going to switch off the fish and chip data so you can see how it looks normally. So that's with the standard data immediately you can see a difference obviously it doesn't show as much information as what you can see with it just to give you another idea i'm just going to head over into port phillip bay and show the kind of examples that can help you off here Now everybody knows that Port Phillip Bay is relatively flat and featureless. Um, as we can see, there isn't much going on, and this is just off Mud Island, where the depths do change a little bit in comparison to the rest of the bay. But once again, if I go into my chart options, turn my fish and chip on, and I'm suddenly seeing the fine changes. Now we're able to see all the extra data here. I can see where it rises, where it falls, everything that we need to be able to see. It's easy to see. Anyway guys, that about does me today. I hope you've learned something about fish and chip and uh, hopefully we'll see more people using it.